Hi everyone, Mike from CCTV Camera Pros here. In this video, I'm gonna demonstrate one of our new Viewtron 4 megapixel IP cameras that has built-in artificial intelligence. It's that bullet camera that you see there behind me. And one of the AI functions that it has built in is object detection. It has the ability to, to detect uh, cars, motorcycles and people. Uh, in this video I'm going to demonstrate the uh, vehicle detection using these parking spots that you see out in front of our warehouse. Let's take a look. Here's the live view of our IP camera on the Viewtron recorder. I'm going to use the mouse to navigate the menu and set up the car object detection. From the main menu I go to the alarm settings then select intrusion from the smart event menu. I had an object detection zone previously set up, so I'm going to clear that zone and start fresh. In the detection target settings, I select car and motorcycle, being that I want to detect vehicles for this object detection test. Next, I'm going to draw an alarm detection zone around these two parking spaces in front of our entrance. When I'm done, I click apply. Here are the alarm setting options that are available when a car is detected in that zone. You can set up snapshot images, mobile app push notifications, uh, alarm buzzer on the DVR, video to pop up on the DVR, and email alerts to be sent. In addition, by default, all vehicle detection events will be bookmarked on the DVR for easy identification for recorded video playback. We are back at the live security camera view again, and what I just did was enable detection visuals so that we can see the AI object detection working in real time. You can see that the NVR is displaying the vehicle detection of those pickup trucks even though they are not inside the alarm zone. To confirm, those objects are being detected by the software, but because they are not in the alarm zone, the alarm is not being triggered. Please note that displaying object detection in real time on the monitor, as I am doing now, is optional. You can also display a live view of this IP camera without the object detection notation. Next, you will see, as I pull into one of the parking spots in the intrusion alarm zone, the camera and NVR detect my car and also detect when it crosses into the object intrusion alarm zone. The Viewtron NVR bookmarks the alarm event and creates a thumbnail snapshot for notation. This makes it easy to access the recorded video playback option. Also, you probably noticed that the object detection software also detected me as a person. I'll be making another video after this one to test and demonstrate the people detection function of Viewtron IP cameras and NVRs. When I want to play back the recorded video surveillance footage of the alarm event, I simply click on the play button on one of these snapshot images. The NVR starts to play back at the exact time of the alarm event. I can then use the video player controls to, play, to control the playback of the video. I'll back it up a bit so that we can see the entire event that occurred. To confirm, this is a 4 megapixel Viewtron IP camera recording to a Viewtron NVR. The object detection is possible because of the AI software built into both devices. When I am done reviewing the recorded video, I can switch back to the live view of the IP camera by clicking on this back button. I can disable the object detection display by clicking on this back button. I'm really excited about this object detection feature that's available in some of our Viewtron IP cameras and Viewtron NVRs. It's really a game changer, guys. Um, it's so much more reliable than video motion detection. If you've ever done video motion detection uh, with IP cameras or BNC cameras, uh, you know just as well as I do, especially in an outdoor environment, there's all kinds of false alarms from things moving like trees, when it's in infrared mode, the pixels on the, from the camera, the pixelation causes video motion. And it's even more reliable in my opinion than passive infrared motion because the artificial intelligence is literally detecting objects, uh, motorcycles, cars, people uh, detection. Those three are what's supported right now. And this is through 
tens of thousands of videos and pictures, more, uh, more probably, probably millions, to build up this catalog of positive detection and knowing that something is that type of object. Anyways, if you want to learn more about these, uh, these IP cameras that have built-in AI, you can learn more at www.cctvcamerapros.com slash AI. Thank you for watching.